this shows us then that the only distinctions between the members of the Trinity are the ways in which they relate to one another and the ways in which they relate to us as God's creation. While the persons of the Trinity are all equal in their attributes, they differ in their relationship to the creation. The Son and the Holy Spirit are equal in deity to God the Father, but they are subordinate in their roles. And of course, when we pray, in a technical sense, true prayer is made to the Father in the name of the Son through the Holy Spirit. That does not mean that it is wrong or unbiblical to pray to the Holy Spirit or to the Son because to say that will be in a sense to deny the deity because they are God. But there is ne nevertheless a pattern set forth that in a technical sense, as we understand that we pray to God, we pray to the Father and we pray because of what the Son has done through the Holy Spirit. But of course we can pray to Jesus, that's biblical. 